Now, you've tried aerobics, jogging, treadmills, and more, committing hours to your exercise routine. But fitness pro Adam Zickerman says you'd be better off with a slow motion workout that takes just 20 to 30 minutes a week. He explains in a new book called The Power of Ten. And Harry and I are all ready to give it a try. Adam, good morning. Good morning. So really, you don't have to spend how many hours in the gym? Are you going to make fun of me? You, before, no, when, when we were not on, All right. he's going like Yeah, this. Oh, yeah, we're ready. Okay, <laughs> so you don't have to spend, I mean, really, a lot of people, an hour, 90 minutes a day, sometimes five days a week. You don't need to do that. No, the starting path to exercise now is weight training, strength training, the safe way, the power of 10 way. No more cardio. Okay. And, but it is no also in... No more cardio? No more cardio? Not if you don't want to do it. Not if you don't have the time to do it. Everyone thinks cardio is going to burn all these cal calories for you. But really, the key is to strength train, raise your metabolism, and nutrition. Simple nutrition. Okay. Before you put us to the test, we're going to do yeah. some exercises. But shouldn't you incorporate cardio, not to lose weight, but for your heart? I mean, you oh, know, yeah, well, for that, health reasons. That's a way of strengthening the heart. But there's also another way now. Studies have shown that strength training is just as beneficial for the heart as other methods now. So, you know, the jury's out now. Uh, a lot of people have been strength training. A lot of cardiac rehab centers are now incorporating strength training into their mm -hmm. cardiac rehab. So, But your whole thing is really nutrition and this strength, kind of strength training. Slow, and safe, high-intensity strength training. Not just strength training in general, but high intensity or the power of 10 strength training, a safe way of lifting weights slowly, fatiguing the muscles to a very deep level of fatigue, and then letting the body rest and, and take care of itself. All right. I'm ready. Do it. Okay. Make it happen. What are we doing here? My book talks about doing it at home, free weights, machines. You're going to spread your legs out a little bit further out like that. Okay. And you're going to keep your hands across here and very slowly lower yourself as slowly as you can. Just like it said that we only use about 10% of our brains, when we work out conventionally, stop right there, we only use 10% of our muscles. Come right back up now. Slowly. I'm feeling it right but, through here. Right. When you're going slower, using more, like 90% of your muscles,